situation. This is where I get most of my facts. A lot, a lot of this stuff is conspiracy theories. Oh, so you have to filter that out. RFK Jr. went on Kill Tony, a live stand-up comedy podcast on YouTube to promote his independent presidential bid and instead of saying a few quick words to get out the vote, his brain worms got the better of him. And Bobby did a minute of, uh, comedy? Take a look. All right, this can't be real. L ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for RFK Jr. This can't possibly be my favorite presidential candidate in the world. Oh my God! It is! Make some fucking noise for RFK Jr. <laughs> 60 seconds uninterrupted starting now for RFK Jr. Oh, I'm not, I'm not a stand-up comic, but I, I wanted to see if I had an aptitude for it. But there's a lot of angry comics back out back in the green room, because they said, if I come out here and I get a laugh, I'm gonna wreck it for William Montgomery. And I don't know who William Montgomery is. Well, my family, as it turns out, loves William Montgomery, too. They can't explain why they like William Montgomery. They just say, well, he's been around a long, long time, and he's not you. And, and if you go out there and you're funnier than William Montgomery, you're going to be a spoiler, and you're going to wreck it for him. And I feel like I'm okay coming out here and talking about William Montgomery. I, all, I said to them, I just want to go out there and say hi to people. And they said, that's too much. <laughs> anyway, I didn't really come prepared to, to tell a joke. <laughs> uh, My, my brain worm wrote some jokes for me. He's very funny. He's got a lot of information. This is where I get most of my facts. A lot, a lot of his stuff is conspiracy theories. Oh, so you have to filter that out. But he's funny. Oh, there were two leprechauns and they were knee-walking drunk. They were so drunk that they could not. That has to be a minute, that has to be a minute. We were, we're let, let's not do, um, let's. Make some noise for Cheryl Hines, everybody, come on. I think that's a minute, and maybe we don't do accents right now. And I think it's good to quit while you're ahead. I'm not gonna quit. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking awesome. How about a hand for RFK Jr. and Cheryl Hines, huh? How cool is this? Cheryl, welcome. How's how's life going uh, post curb right now? It's, it's very relaxing. <laughs> Just brain worms and oh, presidential brain candidacies. Worms. I wake up to all kinds of things. For those of you that don't know, they found. Uh, how do you describe it? For those of you that might not know, there was a worm in his brain. 
uh, we'll say yes. There was a worm in his brain, uh, but it died. And it's it's more common than you think. Wow. Sounds like Dune. Yeah. Huh? It sounds like Dune. <laughs> Dune? Tony, this show has done more for disabled people than the state of California. <laughs> RFK Jr., such an honor to have you here, for you to fucking flex having a sense of humor in front of the best comedy fans on planet Earth. It, it is a fucking pleasure to know that we have the possibility of having this man as the next president of the United States, everybody. To give him the damn kill Tony bump, isn't that right, people? All right, let's keep it moving. Yeah. Another, another bucket pull. Straight out of the bucket. We're going to meet Biden. them all together. Make some noise. <laughs> Make some noise for Jake. 